Academic activities were disrupted at the University of Abuja following the protest match by the union members and our labor correspondent, Ekaite Ebot, who covered the protest, brings us details. The protest kick-started at 9.30 a.m. from the University of Abuja Mini Campus in Guagualada with members of the Senior Staff Association of Nigerian University, SANU, and the Non-Academic Staff of Educational and Associated Institutions, NASU, carrying placards with various descriptions that best described their grievances. From the mini campus, the protesters chanting solidarity songs marched down to the University of Abuja main campus. Speaking at the protest, the national president, Nasu comrade Makolo Hassan, said that the protest signals the beginning of a series of actions which will culminate to the total shutdown of all universities in Nigeria. He lamented that all their efforts to resolve the withheld salary issues with governments has proven abortive. He called on the federal government not to renege on its earlier promises to pay. The Minister of uh, Labor invited us uh, um, about two months ago. We went there, but we were told that she has gone to the presidency for another meeting. Last week, Thursday, she invited us. We went there. We were told she has gone to the presidency for another meeting. And this is a minister uh, that's supposed to take absolute charge and control of this matter. So I wonder what she's going to presidency to report. The chairman, Sanu and Jack, University of Abuja chapter, comrade, Nuruddin Yusuf, while speaking, said their hope was rekindled when President Bola Ahmed Tinubu gave an order in October for the withheld salaries to be paid, only for the hope to be dashed nine months after, as ASU was paid, while other sister unions are still yet to be paid. The president actually followed up with his promise when in October 2023, he graciously approved that the four months with all salaries of our members should be immediately paid and also he also directed that universities should be exempted from IPPIS. Nine months later, after this presidential directive, where is the money? It could be recalled that the National Body of the Joint Action Committee, Jack of NASU and SANU, met on Thursday 4th July to appraise and take position on the current situation in respect of the withheld four-month salaries. Ekaite Ibut, ADBN News.